The Okta Certified Developer exam will require you to use Postman for the purpose of making REST API calls. If you do not already have Postman on your machine, you can download and install it from GetPostman.com. When you open Postman for the first time, it will look something like this. When you register to take the Okta Certified Developer exam, an Okta Preview Org will be created for you. You will also receive a text file that will contain variables and a collection of API calls you will need for the exam. You should import this file into Postman by clicking the Import button on the Postman user interface or click the File menu and choose Import. Postman imports your file and gives you a collection of API calls. To execute a call, simply click it in the left-hand nav pane. Postman loads all of your call details into the detail pane. Here you can change the parameters, authorization, headers, JSON payload, as well as some other settings specific to this API call. When ready, simply click Send. Postman executes your API call and displays any response in the results pane below. For the exam, you will also need to understand how to use Postman variables. You can spot a Postman variable by its two sets of enclosing curly braces. If you mouse over that variable, you can see its design time value. To change a variable's value, simply navigate to the left nav pane of your Postman collection. Click the ellipsis, click Edit, then click the Variables tab. The ensuing grid displays your variables. Here, you can change any of the variable values and click Update. Postman remembers your changes and uses them in ensuing API calls. These are all the Postman skills you will need for the practical section. Good luck on the Okta Certified Developer Exam.